Hi today from London. Today we will say far away to the deceased and we will talk about your death. I have to warn you, this video is gonna shock you. So if you have a sensitive psyche, just don't watch it. But if you watch it, stay with me till the end of this video. There will be a contest and something to win. I think Oscar Wilde once said, you have just one life, but if you do it right, one is enough. So welcome from the cemetery here in Brompton in London. I dedicate this video to my deceased dear uncle who went away some time ago and I visited his funeral and also, of course, the cemetery. And I am one of these people who always hated to go to cemeteries. This is this uneasy feeling, the proximity of death that makes us uncomfortable. That weird feeling that somehow lowers our mood and so on and so on. But this event forced me to go to cemetery, forced me to go to funeral. And I once again realized certain things about life and death that I want to share with you today. And you know from my videos that I often talk about death and how thinking about death makes us more successful in life, helps us achieve more and do big things in life. And some people find it strange. Some people even say I am obsessed with death. No, I am not obsessed with death, but it really helps us to realize some things and to live to the tilt. And starting from the funeral of my uncle, I realized how helpful it is to sometimes visit a cemetery. And I came here to the cemetery in London to record this video for you and to share these thoughts. So the first thing you need to realize is that all of us have a limited time if, in our lives. It may be 60 years, maybe 80 years, maybe 100 years, maybe it is 150 years, who knows? But it is a limited time. And here on this cemetery, there are thousands and thousands of graves. And I haven't found a single person who even experienced the Second World War. So all of these people, they died generations and generations ago. And you need to realize that before you were born, you were not existent for billions of years. And after you die, you will not be existent or you will be dead. Maybe you are religious, but at least you won't be on earth for billions of years again, or maybe for eternity. And only in this window before you were born, you are not existent until you are dead. In this window, you have this opportunity to live and you should use this window to the fullest, to, to live to the tilt, to take every opportunity you come across to live your life, to spend your life, to achieve something, to achieve everything you dream of, to do the things you like and you want to do. Because this is the only opportunity you will get. This is the only time you can do it. You won't be able to do it after your death. And of course, you weren't able to do it before you were born, right? So you have to realize this. This limited window of opportunity. This is one thing. And if you think, you know, death, it will come someday, but it is so far away. I want you to realize this. An average person right now, on average right now, people live 25,000 days. Maybe for some people it's 15,000, for some people, it's uh, 20,000, maybe for some people it's 30,000. But let's say for the ease of the argument, it's 25,000 years. And when I'm recording this video, my subscribers 
amounts to 12 and a half thousand subscribers. Of course, most people aren't old from uh, my subscribers, but let's simplify things. So it means that every other day, one of my subscribers die. If I publish my videos every week, it means between two videos, three people, three of my subscribers may die. It may be you that won't be able to see the next video. It may be even me. So you need to realize that every week from all the subscribers I have, three people die on average. So let's mourn for the three people deceased last week and let's use the time of our life to achieve something, to do something, to create something, to experience something before next week three other people die and it may be you and it may be me. I told you uh, this can be shocking for you but this is the reality and we need to acknowledge this reality and we need to use this reality. But nevertheless, I want to give you a very positive message. If you have worries in your life that this may happen, this may go wrong, you may make this mistake or you may experience this failure or maybe this defeat. Look at all these people here, thousands and thousands of graves. They are all dead. The worst that can happen to you is that you die and you will die for sure. And you need to realize that all your worries, all the, your mishaps, all your failures or your defeats, for most people, nobody will, would care about that. No, nobody would know about that. It won't impact anybody at all. And whatever you achieve here, whatever you accomplish or whatever you create or destroy on this world, it won't matter for sure in several thousand years and certainly not in millions of years, right? And if you don't believe that, if you are in the States, there are American presidents that you don't even know the name and they were the most important or the most powerful people in the world at that time or at least in America, in your country. And now, 200 years later, you don't even know the name. Or do you know who was the wealthiest person in the world in the year 1800? And this person, he was not only the wealthiest, he was probably also the most influential, the most powerful person in the world. And you don't even know his name or her name. Or if you are in England, they are English kings that you have probably never heard about or uh, don't know anything about their lives and what they have accomplished or what problems uh, they had or what they have destroyed or uh, what they have changed or the defeats they have experienced. Even the English kings. So imagine now your life, even if you conquered the whole world or whatever, in several hundred years, in several thousand years, certainly in millions of years, it won't matter at all. So you don't need to worry uh, at, at all about your defeats, about your problems. It is just not important in the scale of the eternity, in the scale of all these ages of history. And if you look at that from the geographical perspective, it is the same. Whatever you accomplish or whatever you uh, do on the earth, earth is just a little point in the endlessness of the universe. It doesn't matter at all. It doesn't impact the universe at all. We are just a little fast at the edge of our galaxy in the endlessness of the universe. So you can as well just release your brakes and push forward 
full throttle uh, to achieve whatever to do, whatever you want, because everything you do won't have any importance whatsoever in the scope of the full history or in the scope of the universe. I hope you like this video. I'm sorry if I shocked you today, but I hope you like this video. If so, give me a thumb up, subscribe below and hit the bell button in order not to miss my other videos. I invite you to comment on that uh, video. What is your experience? What are your thoughts? Uh, what is your perspective? And I promise you a contest. Please share this video on your social media with a quote from that video or with your comment and with the hashtag the billion dollar secret. Hash the billion dollar secret. We will monitor the social media and among the best shares, I will give away one copy of the book I'm writing right now uh, with the title the billion dollar secret where I share the unique knowledge of the best entrepreneurs in the world, the self-made billionaires. I reveal the secret of the mindset, of the thinking, how uh, that makes it possible for them and can make it possible for you to achieve such extraordinary things in business. On this channel, I talk a lot about doing great things about billionaire thinking, about cryptocurrencies. I talk about my investments in uh, cryptocurrencies. Uh, I talk about uh, the financial and philosophical background of cryptocurrencies. I talk about how to do the impossible and I interview the most influential people from the crypto space and also publish parts of my interviews with billionaires on video. So this is a content worth sharing. Share this video with your loved ones, with your friends. They will thank you for that. If you like this video, you will certainly like my other videos. I encourage you to watch them. That's it from London, from the Brompton Cemetery. I wish you a fantastic day. Let's do something extraordinary today.